Little goody two shoes. Little goody two shoes. What up, gang? This is Ken Zerk, Ken Zilling, Gazika Milligan, and Villa the Trilligan, and we are playing Little Goody Two Shoes. Last episode, we did the little thing with the witch and him and all of that. And we we got we we, we got our first death. I was expecting to die a lot in this game, because according to Sunny, this is the Dark Souls of RPG horror. I haven't been having too much trouble. So he probably just sucks at the game if I'm being real. We gotta buy some stuff that's gonna like heal our sanity, dog. Because last time we got our sanity pretty low talking to them golden girls. But there's some weird stuff going on, bro. And it's like, I feel like I gotta talk to those golden girls because they're the ones, they're the only ones that I feel like is actually telling me something that makes sense, you know? But let's investigate these notes first. This wasn't open before. That's to come back some other time. Yes, okay, I got you. I'm, I'm going back. So we got a lease with us. Not a lease, Rosemarine. And now we're gonna be doing the dang, dang thing with the thing and the other thing. Da da, da da, da da, da da, da da, da da. Music's so good, I gotta bust a few nuts. Where everybody at? Where is everyone? That is not her voice. Oh, do folks usually gather here? I wonder if something happened. Come now, Rosemarine, we must find out what's going on. Uh, yes. Ah, uh, yes. Say, Rosemarine, don't you ever get tired of wearing those shoes? My clogs? Aren't they heavy? Oh, not at all, you'd be surprised. Would you like to try them on? Me? Why not? They're really quite convenient. You can't feel the ground as you walk. If I'd be putting these away for some wooden clogs. We can get you a red pair. Why you? <laughs> How sweet. What's going on? Oh, Elise. Mr. Yugen's horses got stolen. What? Is this true, Mrs. Mariel? Not a liar, Elise. Yes, I'm afraid it's true. Everyone's acting strange, Elise. That's natural, my dear. This isn't something to take lightly. I heard some folks say that we were, they were hag-ridden. Hag-ridden? You shouldn't spread such nonsense around town, Groon. But old Joe just said the horses were stolen by a witch. Oh, for goodness sake. Poor lad couldn't be more heartbroken. For good reason. Go on, I'm looking after the children for another time being. Dang, so old dude horses got stolen. Ah, Elise, Rosemarine. Good morning, Freya, Lab Kuchin. You've heard, I'm assuming? About Mr. Ugin's horses? Oh, it's been awful. Everyone's been on edge. Folks don't know what to do with themselves. For good reason, I'd say, but... Mr. Ugin was so invested in his business, too. Oh, Jochen's Tom. Oh, Jochen's foolery isn't helping anyone. I can already tell. They were hagridden. Nothing tells me you know what that means. Lebkuchin. Oh, of course. It's when. Oh, she wouldn't know Lebkuchin. Saved. I suppose not. What a way to start the day. I think I'll take a look around town. Be careful. Folks are getting nervous. Oh, she's so attractive. Oh, I can keep you company. I can keep you company. Wouldn't know about that, Dorothy. Oh, there you are, you two. You can always ask Elise. Ask me what? Oh, but before we do, have you heard Elise? Mr. Ugin's horses? Poor lad. I think my father's name is compromised, too. Mr. Bernard's. Earnhardt. Someone put the horse's saddles on one of my father's pigs. It's a sick joke, that's what it is. Sounds like it. You're leaving Kieferberg, aren't you? Maybe one day, Mrs. Brunhill Day, but are you? Been discussing the idea, as a matter of fact. How could this happen to us? Okay, but where do I go to actually, like, you know, see what's going on? I'd let him know, aren't we, Marlin? This is about the horses. It goes further than that. Whoever took a horse and broke into the pigsty, took our pigs, soldered them like a horse, and locked them in the stables. 
Can you believe such a thing? A vile prank. I need to know the folks that know Bernhard had nothing to do with this. All of Kieferberg knows you would never do such a thing, Marlin. I'm sorry to hear about that. See where this takes us. Thank you, lass. Taking Yukin's horses was too cruel. One who could do such a thing. Poor lad was just getting his business started. Hard to believe he provoked any kind of ill will. I doubt any of our Tom folks could do that. I agree, Heinrich. I hear Elizabeth's goats aren't doing so well either. We'll go have a look. Stables. Where are the stables at? Do I have... Is, is V-Sync a thing in, in here? No wonder it was doing that stupid crap. I got V-Sync on. I'm telling you folks, this can't be good. It clearly can't, Odelli. The last horse has vanished. Shouldn't believe such nonsense, Mrs. Odelli. Far from nonsense, the horses were hag-ridden. That hardly matters. I say you getting losing this horse is a bigger concern. You folks never take anything seriously. Let's see what Mr. Ogden's doing. I don't know where that bum is. Is he up here? Oh, here he is. Y'all gotta tell me these things. Hmm. You two have heard, I'm sure. We have. So we're trying to figure out what happened. I'm ruined, that's what happened. <sighs> As I said before, Yugen, we will do all we can to help. We'll gather the lads and send them out to patrol the outskirts. Hmm. Are we absolutely sure they were stolen? About that, at least. Those horses were hag ridden, I tell you. Not this nonsense again. I tell you, lad, there's a witch in Kieferberg. Even if they were hag ridden, it. it's still a sad day for Mr. Yugen, old Jochen. This isn't the time. I'll ask you not to try folks' patience, old Jochen. Or anyone else's, for that matter. Hmm. Which or no which, folks. Someone had to do it. There's no two ways about it. Without as much as a trot or Renee. All I got there this morning were Bernhard's pigs in the saddle. Don't rope me into this lad. I already told you I had nothing to do with it. Who am I to blame then, the witch? Hmm. Let's keep calm now, folks. Ah. <sighs> I can't fault, can't fault the poor lad for it now, can we, folks? Finn, Guido, and we'll, we'll look around the outskirts. I'll go with you, Gustav. We should ask you again if you'd like to join us, too. Um, I... Is there any way we can help, Mr. Gustav? Keep folks calm, Elise, and go about your day as you normally would. Leave it to us, lads. We'll get to the bottom of this. Um... Folks truly are on edge today. I ought to be careful of what I say around town. Oh, snap, there you are. Mommy. It's you. <laughs> Pretending not to see me, were you? Oh, for goodness sake, Maggie, I don't have time for this. Give me the grape juice, Elise. I didn't have breakfast today, so. That's it, I'm telling your auntie you're begging for food again. <laughs> oh, but I'm not begging, Elise. I saw you have a goat now. Why, am I not allowed to have a goat? <laughs> Holly, Elise, you're dirt poor. How would you get your hands on a goat? Mommy. Why you? <laughs> My goodness. I hate her. For goodness sake. Dare tell anyone about that wretched goat and I'll freaking murder you. Mommy. <laughs> Out with it. Out of my sight, Mindy! Hurry it up! Hurry that costs too much! I don't have money for that. Yo, I'm tired. Of, bro, can we kill her? All right, now let's meet Rosemary. There she is.
Let's spend time with her. Elise. Oh, I'm so glad you came, Elise. Anything to get me out of that rat hole. And I think I have to deal with those folk all, all day. Okay, I'm recording. I can lend you a hand at least whenever you need. Uh, that aside, Rosemary, what was it you wanted to show me? Ah, uh, this is somewhat embarrassing, but look at this, Elise. A pinecon? That's what you wanted to show me? Uh, it's more important than you think. This pinecon is my treasure, Elise. Huh? Granny gave it to me when I was little. Your granny, huh? I understand how she feels, I suppose. Sorry, I... We're just the same as this pine cone, at least. How am I the same of how am I the same of a pine cone, Rosemary? Oh, but, uh... oh, I promise there's a proper meaning to what I'm saying. <sighs> alright, alright. Our time here in this realm is rather limited, isn't it? I suppose. You, mentioned... you see how the pine cone is covered in scales? If you think of it as yourself and your life up until this moment. You can understand. You can understand how each scale represents something, right? I see. Your experiences and dreams, the things you hold dear, all those things are just the same as the scales on this pine cone. Rosemary. <sighs> there are times when one falls off and gets damaged. You don't feel as whole anymore, but you learn to be without it and find that and find that losing one doesn't mean you that you'll lose all the others. <laughs> oh, Elise. This pine cone is the representation of my path. It represents you, Elise. I've been meaning to tell you all about it for so long. For goodness sake. All these scales represents the path I've taken to reach you. <laughs> and now that I'm by your side, I feel whole like never before. You see what I mean, don't you, Elise? You. I do, I do. I'm so glad I could finally tell you about it. Flock is one of these scales too. Did you know that he's... For goodness sake. Breathe, Rosemarine. Oh, you make me whole, Elise. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Oh, don't get flustered. I'll get flustered too. Oh, shut, shut up! Come now. We ought to head back to town. Before we do, Elise, won't you meet me at the viewpoint tomorrow morning? All right, all right. I'll be spending all my time with you at this rate. I'm sorry. Oh, if you're too busy, then. Rosemary. Oh, I... She's such a sweetie. I love her. Ah, right, we gotta work today. Today, to this, not today, but this hour and the next hour, we gotta work. Let's see about this windmill. This wasn't open before. Someone's been in here recently. I have to be careful. Oh, Lord. What is this? An owl? <laughs> oh, be help. Looks like an altar of some sort. Bro thought he was gone. Dude really thought he was just gonna break. Break out of nowhere and catch me lacking. Horse. John got nothing to say about the horse. Let's keep pushing. A wooden serif. Oh, run. This cave is broken in half. What's this doll doing in such a place anyhow? It's so flimsy too. I could break it rather easily, couldn't I?
I'm, I'm a curious George. It's like a door. I wonder if I can get it open somehow. What if I sit the doll here? Break it? Seraph's head. Seraph's body. Seraph's legs. Ooh, I got it, I got it, I figured it out. An owl, looks like an altar of some sort. Oh, legs. Alright, what I'm gonna do... Oh, dang, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. <laughs> Is Rose and Marine helpful, though? That's the question. How many is that? 37? That's a B. Oh, that's an A! Let's get it! Thank you, Elise. You've truly been helpful. I do not know. I do not think it was worth it. I'm not bringing Rosemary along next time. They're back from looking for the horses, but... Horses, horseshoes scattered about, you say. Hmm. Fine, I'll just pass the logging grounds, but Lord's name would anyone remove the horseshoes. I don't want to lean weight to old Jochen's nonsense, but wake up, lads. They were hag ridden, I tell you. Yeah. Isn't it time we must keep calm? Thank you for your time today, lads. I'll be moving along now. I've had enough wandering about. I've never seen him so disheartened, I must say. To think you lads didn't find even a trace. You looked everywhere, Mrs. Marlin, the peach, the lake. Heinrich and Tristan even followed the path to Primaldor. Hmm. We ought to give it another try first thing. <laughs> uh, I found it, I found it! I found the horses right outside! What are you saying, Maggie? <laughs> it's the truth, it's lying on the ground! <laughs> Is it alive? Take us to it, lassie. My word. Oh, the poor thing. What in the Lord's name? Good grief, it's nearly dead. What do you make of it, Eugen? He's exhausted, I say. He, I say he ran all, He ran here by the looks of it. No, that can't be. We've only just made it back. You would have found him or heard him. I must say I'm at a loss, lads. They were hag ridden, no two ways about it. Look at it gasping for breath. Ew, look at its eyes. Keep calm, old Jochen. Then you can nurse him back to health, Yugen. I'm taking him back to the stables right now. I'll lend a hand, Yugen. You fools ought not touch that horse. Lord knows what the witch has done to it. Come now, lads. Let's fetch him some water. Must have broken free from wherever he was being kept. Broke off the reins and ran back to Kieferberg. I can't think of. Nonsense, Bernard. I'll have it set right here, right now, folks. It's best you sow some restraint, old Jochen. This isn't... Old Stefan warned us about this. Not this old Stefan nonsense again, you old fool. We need to keep calm, folks. Arguing about this won't... Have you no memory of his words, Hans Gustav? He spoke of the ill fortune we'd have of the witch. 
The old folks lively and slipping through their fingers. <sighs> old Stefan was a tormented lad on his deathbed, old Jochen. There is worse to come, folks. Mark my words. Hmm. What are we to do with them, father? Just wait for him to tire himself out. That's all we can do. Come, folks. Let's head back to town. Bro pointed right at me. Hmm. These are starting to get a lot of hand, aren't they? What is this? If everything goes swimmingly, we should be able to just go in and finish this up. You know, do the do the investigation. I honestly should be able to just speed run this now. Since I know what I'm doing. I just watch the sanity. Gotta do this fast. Take the head. Take the legs. Take the body. All right, now we're here. Fish key. It's like a fish. I wonder what this is for. Someone has to be behind all this nonsense. I have a bad feeling about this. All right, take this. Diary entry. Can't piece of paper. Belief is a complex matter, as are its various manifestations. The human need for faith has led many down the path of ruin. Pagan heretics, covenants, and non-believers, all of them plentiful and diverse. That was until our Lord's way and glory rescued them from the pits of hell. The Lord's guidance, his benevolence has purified deities and purged their sinful acts. Converted their false pagan piety into adoration of the, for the Lord. Now our saints recognized by the church. Banished witches, their covenants and cults to receive them as leaders of faith. St. Walperga herself, born a witch and later baptized by the Lord. Her soul sanctified, divorced from the witch Walperga. St. Walperga cannot be capable of producing such miracles, the birth of a child no less. I ought to delve deeper into our patroness's past, into what old Hall could have meant. For the sake of Kieferberg and for all that depend on me for salvation, I must find out what exactly Old Holly saw and did years ago. I must continue my research for Elisa's sake as well. What? This is Father Han's writing. What does he know about Granny Holly that I don't? And why is he doing this? Man-sized sigil appears chiseled. I mean, I can try the key on this, but I doubt it's gonna work. All right, get out of there, get out of here, get out of here. We're done, we're done, we're done. Mm. Wonder what I'm stumbling upon here. These notes and keys, these rituals of sorts. Someone ought to be putting these together for some purpose, but who? Who'd be doing such a thing? All right, great, let's make some money. Feeling the pressure, aren't we all? I hate to ask you, fresh me some apples. Of course. No. I think I did good last time.
Come on, that's an A, that's an A. That's an A, that's an A. 145, that's an A. That's an S. That's an S. Oh, this is just what I needed, Elise. Thank you so much, my dear. Of course, Miss Linda, thank you. It's nighttime. I gotta just hit the store. Y'all know me, bro. I ball on a budget. I, I, I'm not good at resource management games, bro. I'm not good at those, man. I, I'm like, if you put me in a resource management game, I'm gonna be, I'm literally, I'm just gonna be balling on a budget. I'm gonna be broke and making it work. I'm gonna be broke and making it work. Elise! Oh, what does this old hag want now? Where do you think you're going, Elise? Huh? I need to have a word with you. What's this about, Mrs. Bertha? Your cousin, that's what this is about, Elise. The lass has been wandering around town, you know. She's been helping me out, Mrs. Bertha. No, I don't think so. Your cousin keeps telling folks there's no thief in Kieferberg. So has old Jochen. He's been insisting on that hag riding, isn't hasn't he? Oh, Jochen's one thing, but your cousin has no right to be spreading such nonsense. All right, I can have a word with her, I suppose. I to make certain I bring Rosemary to work with me, or I have to deal with this every day. She just loves to make things harder for me, bruh. Thought you'd never come? Oh, spare me. Here's your bread. Thank you. Do you tell? You're not as mysterious as you think you are. Now that's better. Move along, Elise. It's best we head to bed early tonight. Lord knows I can use some good sleep. How is he to know when you hardly ever pray, Elise? It's not as though he makes for- Oh, come on! It's not as though he makes for good conversation, so why bother? Good night, Lepkuchin. Come on, you gotta pray. I mean, I gotta pray too. I've been slacking on my prayer, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna be real with y'all. I gotta get back praying. Another one? That's Mr. Yugen's. You've come, you've come. This crow is speaking to me. You're wearing them, you're wearing them. Shiny, shiny. What What's the meaning of this? Who's there? The Hex, the Hex. You're the bearer of the Hex. Hex, what Hex? The Hex, the Hex. You've heard of it. You're wearing it as we speak. The Hex, the Hex. Stay away. Show it to me, show it to me. I have nothing to show you, go away. Why, yes you do, your desire, your fervent greed, your boundless hunger for glory. Show it to us, show it to us. My eye! What have you done to my eye? Show it to us, show it to us! It. You wretch! A testament to your tender flesh is awaiting you in my grove. A testament? Our grove, our grove! Wait! Wait, you! I'm awaiting you, Elise, in my ceramic grove of wheat. A testament? I ought to let Mr. Yugen know about this horse. Dog, I am hungry. <laughs> Mr. Yugen! Good lord, at least what's got you in a hurry? There's a horse in the crossroads! Are you certain, Elise? Uh -huh. Yes, yes, I'm certain! 
Lass says she's found your horse, Yugen. Take me there, Lass. I'll go fetch the others. You know, but it's I... dead, Mr. Yugen. It matters not, Lass. Take me there. Or I swear if the horse disappears. I'm killing everybody. What in the Lord's name? It, it was right here, I swear. Good Lord, Elise. Would you tell us what you saw, Elise? Wait. There were crows and the horse was... Are you certain this is where you saw it? Yes, yes I am. You're tired, Elise. I'm certain this was just... There's only one answer for this, folks. You're lying, Elise. I'm not lying, you old fool. If you'd let me explain, I could tell you. You said the horde was dead, Elise. And it was. How could a dead horse trot away, would you say? It's no use trying to reason with her, Tristan. She's lying. Oh, Elise, of all things to lie about. And what is it with these crows? Wait. It's the truth. I've had enough. I'll be in the stables. Tell us, Elise, are you speaking the truth? We gotta Cause they don't accept they don't they don't accept any answer that isn't literal meat sucking, bro. So maybe I'm just tired. Uh... Yet I'm not certain. I could have sworn. What do you mean you're not certain you? I'm simply not old Joach, and I may be too tired. It's mm -hmm. I can accept that Elise. But I can't, Gustav. She still has yet to explain the crows. As I said, Father, I think I saw what I saw. I won't deny any of what I said. Please. I'm just shocked to see there's nothing here. Uh -huh. Truly, I wouldn't lie about such a thing. You think you've got us fooled, huh? <sighs> you shouldn't make such accusations. It's best we... Can't you folks see she's trying to deceive us? You know something, Elise. What? I don't know what it is, but I'll have it said, Lassie. You can dance with the devil all you want, but you won't. That's ridiculous. That's enough. We've all had a difficult day today, folks. We're all exhausted, drained, and on edge, are we not? Why are you trying to defend your... No, Lepkuchin's quite right, old Jochen. Let us turn in for the night. We can come back to this tomorrow. I'd like to have a word with you, Gustav. You too, Lebkuchen. Hmm. No need, father. I trust Lebkuchen's judgment. <sighs> Yet I don't. I see. I'll go with you, father. Hmm. You're going home, Elise. You should think long and hard about what you've done. Or fuck you, nigga. Why does it keep doing this? I don't like this at all. Full Metal Alchemist! That was dangerous. I'm worried about Levkuchin, but I ought to get home and tell Rosemary what I saw. Man, this some bully bully bullshit. Please. This is bad. This is very bad. Had it not been for Levkuchin, those folks would have... They would have found out about everything. About the woods, about what I did. That's right. I best get those I best get to that crow's grave. The testament, they have the tender flesh. I should Rose and Marine? Are you right, Elise? What's wrong, Elise? I don't know where to start, Rose Marine. I'm so tired. Huh? It's this this rotten pig's the other town. Elise. I saw one of Mr. Yugen's horses on the way home, Rose Marine. It was dead, but it was riddled with crows and Sorry, I... I don't understand, Elise. You should tell. You know, More importantly, I... Rosemary, there was a golden crow. He said he's got a testament. <laughs> oh, Elise, a testament. Uh... Um, this is too much for me, Rosemary. But... What else did he say, Elise? Uh... I'm so tired. I ran back to town to tell everyone about the horse and they... They humiliated me, Rosemary. 
each and every day I'm treated as though I'm some wretch. No matter what I do or say, I'm always, always. This wish of mine, Rosemarine, can I truly trust him to grant it? Yes. If you devote yourself to him and do his bidding, you're already aware of the sacrifice you'll have to make, but it's... I would sacrifice all of Kieferberg if I had to, Rosemarine. Huh? Can't stay another day in this town. I have no choice but to find him. Oh, but, uh... Take me with you, Elise. You're going there again tonight, aren't you? To the woods? Mm. Alright, I'll, I'll let you know when I'm ready. Elise. You look nervous, Elise. Mm. That's because I am, Rosemarine. Sorry, I... We could talk about it. I can try and... No, it's alright. I don't want to think about it. Let's go, Rosemarine. I just can't help but feel like this is not what we should be doing. Keep close to me, Rosemarine. Lord knows what we're going to find. You still haven't told me about last right. evening's. Whatever happens, Rosemarine, promise you'll keep close to me. Uh, of course. Are you alright, Elise? Come, let's go. Elise! I don't think we should be doing this, Elise. So we're going back into the woodland. Oh, where are we going? I forgot. Okay, so yes, the woodland. This is where it happened, Rosemarine. Elise, look! Those are horseshoes. There are so many, too. These weren't here earlier, Rosemarine. Doesn't make any sense. There are feathers scattered about, too. Are these from the crows you said you saw? I don't know what to make of this, Rosemarine. Come, Elise, we have no choice but to see for ourselves. He did not stick close. Rosemarine? Rosemarine! For goodness sake! Silly lass, she must have watered in all by herself. Rosemarine! Rosemarine! Oh no, we're going in the silly hour! We got elevators now? Rosemarine! 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 Her goodness sake. Where in the Lord's name does she go? I'd best carry on, I suppose. There's no going back. I can't run? Where in the Lord's name does she go? Pleasant surprise! Pleasant surprise! How pleasant it is to see you here, lass! I thought you were the ones that invited me, Crow. And every lass who gets the shoes wind up here. There have been others. You're not special! You're not special! Fucking asshole. What were you thinking wandering off like that? Uh, I'm sorry. 
I told you to stay close to me. I got a little distracted is all. Isn't it time or place to get distracted, Rosemarine? We don't know what could be in these woods. Why her eyes look dead? Come now, we can't sit around all night. Such a bizarre place. Most is rather noticeable. Who's influence? Who else? A ring. What? A ring? That's the crows. What did you say, Rosemarine? You've come, you've come. Look who it is, look who it is. You've brought me such good company Enough too. What are you wittering on about, you wretch? You've done well in coming here, lassie. You best give me what you promised, crow. What he promised? The testament, the testament. Where is it, crow? Come a little further under my grove, lass. Why are you little? I didn't hear about this. Show it to me, show it to me. What is she to show you, Crow? Rose and Marine? Hey, give me back that ring, you! Show me how far those ruby shoes will take you. All you desire, lass. It's so close yet so far. Uh. You can at least tell me your name, Crow, if you have one. Secret, secret! Are you wretched predators? Answer my- Enough chatting, enough chatting! Come find me if you'd like to know more. Wait! Hmm. Suppose we ought to find him. What's gotten into you, Rosemarine? You're not yourself. What do you mean? What the hell would it? Let's go find that wretched bird. I don't know if I trust you, Rosemarine. I think we should. I don't think we should trust that crow. All right, out with the Rosemarine. You've been, you haven't been yourself since we got here. I'm a little nervous is all. So am I, but short. Sure. Guess we don't get distracted now. She's rather cold, isn't she? But I said it earlier, didn't I? Like her eyes look dead. Like she's possessed or something. What is her issue? Yo, I'm gonna be so real with y'all. I've got half a mind to just go home. In all seriousness, I've got half a mind to just go home. Oh dear lord. It's a golden girl. Let's talk to her. You're going forth with his inv invitation, I see. What would that matter to you? I was once in your shoes, haughtiness and all. Oh, but it won't be long now, will it? Until? Your eyes are forced open, then you'll see. That hit this this that this mimicry of theirs isn't without reason, girl. I know when I'm being mocked, thank you very much. You're not being mocked, you're being warned! <laughs> ah! Is it the broken? How much does go? Oh, I thought we wouldn't see the end of it. Come now, Rosemary, let's get out of here. I'm not sure it's that easy. No, it's nothing, let's go. The crow is toying with me, that's what he's doing. I can't say I'm fond of him either. It's best we hurry out of these woods. You know a lot about this. I tend to know a great deal of things. I get to know a great deal about things, don't I? She won't even say my name. It is not too late. It is not too late to just go back. I promise you it's not too late to go back.
He will be pleased. He will be pleased. Where's the testament? Come further, lads. Come further. I've had it with you. You need to tell me where to find it to get out of my sight. Hmm. It's best you don't speak to him like that. Rosa Marine? Huh? All the answers you seek lie deeper within these woods, lassie. Uh -huh. Will you give me the tender flesh then? Meet me in the wheat field. Show me your resolution. The wheat field? You have my word. You have my word. Huh. That wretched bird's playing with me. A wheat field. Rosa it's nothing. We ought to go after him. She's hiding something. So it's true. So it's true. I'll never get used to you feather rat screeching. She's here, she's here. It's best we move along. She brought the witch, she brought the witch. You know, I... What are they going going about now, Rosemarine? You're in our lair, witch. You have no hand in this grove. Out with it. You've got the wrong last crows, now let us through. I suppose it's because of the hat? You're in our lair. The lair of Lord, whatever. The lair of Lord, the lair of Lord. Do you know who that is, Rosemarine? You know him too. He's our merciful Marquis. That Groden Crow's name. It's best we move along now. I'm sorry. What for? I'm aware I'm a little antsy, but this place makes me nervous, you see? That's alright. I'm not too pleased to be here. Hoping she'd be a little more supportive. I'm not even certain what I was expecting by bringing her here. How I loathe you naive sheep. Following his blissful words into this moonless hellfire of ours. What are you? We've, we've all fed his gluttony one after the other. Our sins on earth made into a spectacle for all to see. Who is he? Your fate as one of us is sealed, you foolish girl. What in the Lord's name is she wittering on about? Elise. Elise, we messed up. Mean to tell you, best you don't trust anyone you meet here, or even anything you see in these woods. The tr this truly is the path to reach your dreams. I wouldn't lie to you about such a thing, but I ought to say, this might take more from you than you're anticipating. Why are you telling me this now? I would grant your wish myself. Getting involved with him is dangerous, Elise. It's be for the best if you simply stay. With me. She's going back and forth between fault trusting him and trust and not trusting him. The fuck? I'm gonna end my life. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, snap. I did not see him. They're about to beat the shit out of me. They are kicking my cheeks in. Oh my lordy lord. Wait! 
Wait, you! You sure likes to be chased around, huh? Come now, before he decides to fly away again. Guess we don't stay here much longer. What do you mean? I don't think it's a good to get too close to that crow. Oh, I just squeezing my balls. A crow slate. What's this stone slab? Fancy seeing you, fancy seeing you. So I don't understand what you want from me, Crow. Your resolve, your resolve. I have plenty of that. Don't provoke him. Provoke me, provoke me. Follow your instinct, Glass. Pay no heed to this creature you've brought along. He's no creature, you wretch. Yet, since you insist. Who is he? You ought to know him rather well. His name is to remain unspoken, lass. Whatever his name is, isn't any concern to me, Crow. I want to know more about him and his intentions. What about him? What about him? Why he's gifted me these shoes, for instance. You're right, he's gifted them to you. Paved your way to meet him on the night of the full moon. With nothing other than a hex. The night of the full moon. St. Walpurgis Eve. The day of the festival? We're to feast upon your greed. We're to feast upon your greed. He's gifted me a hex. Find me in the wheat field, in the wheat field. He's not one to sit and chat, is he? Sorry if I'm not giving a lot of commentary right now. I'm kind of locking in. Y'all see, I'm not exactly in the best situation. I've got to pay close attention so I don't mess up and die. <laughs> Put that there. Put that there. And put that there. Talk to the golden girl. Uh, how long has it been, I wonder? Tell me, how long has it been? Since when? Since you were bamboozled by one of us. Why you? I'm not like the others. I'm not one to share my sorrows. You'll be joining us soon enough, whether you like it or not. Out of my sight. Look at your face, look at your face. For goodness sake, everything in here is infuriating. Hate to say it, but I trust those things way more than I trust Rosemarine right now, bruh. Why is she running? Okay. She's being such a strange creature. Impressive, lass. Impressive, lass. For goodness What's gotten sake. into you, Rosemarine? Who's Rosemarine? Who's Rosemarine? Uh. Ever since we got here, you haven't... Who's Rosemarine? Who's Rosemarine? Wait! Wait, Rosemarine? Who's Rosemarine? Who's Rosemarine? Shut up! You're just in time for the tender flesh, lass. The tender flesh, that's... The testament, the testament! My eye! Tender flesh, tender flesh. 
or rather peckish, rather peckish. I'm telling you to stay away from me. Can eat a horse, can eat a horse. No, wait. May thy flesh serve him, may thy flesh serve him. Is this the flesh? My own hair, a part of me, my mortal body. Just like Rosemarine told me. Oh, I must find her. Lord knows what those crows did to her. Rosemarine, what's, what's, what's going on? Can you hear it, Elise? The woodland, my grove, it's aching. What are you saying, Rosemary? You've lost your wits the moment we got here. Even under their influence, it's still- Stop with it! I'm serious, Rosemary, that's enough. It's aching for what was taken from its bosom, Elise. Now that you're here, it's reacting to you. Rosemary. I still don't understand, Rosemary. What are- Can you hear it? You're what? These roots, the earth. They'll guide you to your rightful place, Elise. Out with it! I don't have time for this nonsense, Rosemarine. I've done what I came here to do. We ought to leave. To the womb, Elise. Where you were conceived, where you will go to meet your fate. You're not listening! To think he's once more trying to take you away from me. Turn my bosom into this parched wasteland and yet... This womb of mine still responds to your presence all the what same. Is this? I'll bring you home, Elise. I'll do everything in my power to. Take my hand! What in the Lord's name? I will bring you home, Elise. Come with me, Rosemary. We have to get you out of here. What? Why is it so fast? What the freak was- What's going on? Save. Go, just go. Go, go. Okay, I got a second try. That's hard. I realize the shadow show. Dear Lord. Is it is it gone, Rosemary? Hmm. I suppose. What was that? That thing, anyhow. They're preparing for your arrival, it seems. What is this? 
That's me? Hmm. I've never seen him this eager, I must say. What in the Lord's name? You'll slip away if I don't hurry, I'll lose you. Rose and Marine! Rose Marine, what's wrong with you? Elise. Out with it! I've had it. We're leaving this place. And we're not coming back either. <laughs> ah! No! No! What are you doing? Frozen Marine! Come quick, you have to get up! I'll lose you again, my beloved. If I don't hurry, you'll slip away. You're not Rosen Marine. So is Rose Marine the witch? Or was Rose Marine like or did the witch like copy her likeness? What? Oh, what am I to do? I feel so confused. I don't know what I'm doing or where I'm going. That wasn't Rosemary either. Oh, what am I getting myself into? I'm so utterly alone. Let me guide you, Elise. No. No. Rosemary. Wild and wandering pistol. When did I get here? That dream I had about Rosemarine. Rose and Marine. I have to find her. My eye. That wretched crow. I ought to find Rosemarine. I'm not finding nothing. I'm worn out. What the freak is going on? That's the end of the episode, guys. If y'all enjoy it, like, subscribe, leave a comment to read a mod tap into the next one. Look, I've had my suspicions 
I've had my suspicions for a minute. But right now, if I can not do this ritual, I'm going to, bruh. Because at least need to realize, like, I need at least to lock in and realize, like, this is not gonna go the way that she wants it to go. This is not gonna go the way she thinks it's gonna go at all. This is only going to go bad. She needs to lock in and realize that. And hopefully that happens and I can get a good ending. But peace out. I love y'all. Tap into the next one.